Hi guys, I have found this very powerful AI tool to merge your architecture and interior design renders into complete animation videos. Yes, all we need is to upload the final renders of our project. Just upload the first keyframe and then add a second keyframe for the animation. Adjust the basic settings and click on generate. Now once the animation is ready, we can edit it, extend it by adding more keyframes upscale it or add audio to the video. Now this AI tool is called Dream Machine AI. It's from Luma Labs. I have shared a link for it below. Once you open the website, this landing page will simply blow you away. I just love playing around with these graphics as I find them very inspiring. I want you to go on try now. Now simply sign in with your Google account. Once signed in, this page appears. I just want you to click on this plus option to create a new board. Now Dream Machine is used to generate images and videos. I have already briefly shown you in the intro how to generate a video from your own images. So this time let's generate an image and create a video from it. Just select image, adjust the bit basic settings, type a prompt. I'll type house on the beach in Saha Hadid style. Just click on generate to see what happens. Image generation is quite fast I must say. We have generated these four different options. I like this one the most I think. No this is also better. So we have an option to modify it if we don't like any of the image. But right now we will go to make video. Just click on it. Now over here we have this camera option. We can adjust how our camera movement will be in our animation. This is quite helpful in our video generation. I think I'll just go with this orbit right. You can type some other instructions in the prompt as well or add another keyframe. But right now I'll just click on generate to see what happens. Now remember the video generation does take a lot of time as compared to the image generation. But that largely depends on your subscription plan. The premium plans are much faster as compared to the less expensive ones. And our video is ready. Looks pretty nice I must say. The image is quite clear and the video quality is nice. You can always modify it if you don't like anything. Now let's go to a real life scenario. As a professional architect I have designed this house and created the 3Ds and taken renders of this building. But now my client wants 3D animation of the video and I don't have the tools to create it. So I'll use Dream Machine for it. Now I have already numbered the renders from 0 to 3 according to the keyframes I want them to be. Let's, let's just view them. This shall be the first frame of my video, then the second, third and fourth. Basically I want the camera to rotate around my building with slight movement of all these characters around it. So I'll go to Dream Machine, I'll select the settings to video, go to keyframes. Now remember at a time we only have options to upload two keyframes. So I'll just upload the first keyframe and then the second keyframe and I will generate a video with these two keyframes and Dream Machine has generated this 5 second animation. I'll simply go to extend video now and this animation is loaded already. I'll just add another end frame. This time I'll add the third one. Click on open and hit generate again. Now a 9 second video is generated with the first 5 second video in the start and the third keyframe added at the end of that video to create it in a 9 second video. So now I'll just extend the video even more by adding the last keyframe that I saved and just upload it. And this time a 12 second video is generated. Now let's just an analyze the video. This cyclist starts at the start and then he comes and stops over here then he's going back a little bit. This car movement is also a bit haphazard. This guy is not moving in the start then he will move at the end of the video. So these are slight glitches in the video. These are because the keyframes were not properly adjusted for the video. They were just basically renders that I took from different angles. With more practice and uh, effort you can fix these problems and make your transitions and your animations look seamless. For now this is good enough for me because it is saving me a, hell, a lot of time. So I'll just use this for my product, my project. Now we have an option of reframe that I will use as I want my video to be in a ratio of 9 by 16 and I'll just adjust it according to that ratio. Uh, this looks good because 9 by 16 is pretty helpful in viewing in the mobile phones these days. 
and I'll just click on generate and the video is adjusted in a 9x16 frame looks pretty nice now I'll just simply download it and then say share it with my client now for the real question is it all for free well the question is yes and no cause dream machine does offer free plan but I don't recommend you guys using it cause the generations is very slow in this plan and you don't even have commercial rights for it so what I recommend is using this web plus plan it's about $30 but it's really worth it with all the uh, 10,000 monthly credits and high quality images and you get commercial use and no watermarks so I definitely recommend you guys using this plan you can access it with my affiliate link given below so do give it a try and type in the comments how was your experience with dream machine that's it for today I hope you like this video take care goodbye